You want to think of your stomach as a wash machine. So if you have a load of towels and you're, you put them in the wash machine and it's packed full of towels, you're going to set that on heavy load, right? And it's going to fill up the washing machine pretty high because those towels have to mix and churn. Everything's got to mix and churn, okay? Your stomach is the same way. You want to fill up with some of these digestive enzymes so when the food hits the stomach, it's, it's mixing and churning. And if they watch stomachs digest, which they can do, they're pretty active. Sometimes you hear them gurgling and doing all these noises, right? There's a lot of that mixing and churning going on. And the whole idea is to get this to a real liquidy form, okay? And, and it turns into something called chyme. And we've all thrown up chyme, <laughs> right? If you've ever thrown up, you know what it looks like. It's pretty liquidy, right? Unless it's only been an hour after you ate, maybe not so. But it, it should, uh, it depends on what we ate for dinner. If we ate something heavier, like a meat protein, it's gonna take longer. So it's anywhere from three to four hours that it takes for your something. If you ate something really light, like soup and salad or something, it might just be a couple hours, but it should be in and out of the stomach, right? So this is a happy stomach that's doing all this work and doing great.